Hi, I'm Katie Allman reporting for Katie Chats at the Canadian Comedy Awards at the Centre Point Theatre in Ottawa. I am here with Peter and Chris. How does it feel to be nominated for a Canadian Comedy Award? Feels really great. Um, yeah, we were nominated last year and we couldn't attend and I'm glad that we could uh, be here this year. Great. Yeah, it's, it's just really great to be here uh, with my buddy Chris and uh, you know, uh, it's not often we actually get to travel together so uh, it's true. it just feels really good. That's nice, Peter. Yeah. What is the funniest part about traveling together from Vancouver all the way here to Ottawa? Uh, the funniest part about traveling, um, the train was pretty funny. It's a lot of a lot of fun was had on that train. We we had a lot of fun on the airplane as well. That's true. With we the, get up to think. We like to sit together. Yeah, we like I to. I always take the window seat. <laughs> I always squeeze his knee a little bit yeah. and you know yeah, like tickle true. him. So yeah, yeah. yeah. How did the two of you? Over it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. How did the two of you meet and start working together? Oh, uh, let me let me feel this. Um, we met in uh, Victoria yeah. uh, when we were going to school uh, for a theater program, sure. and uh, there was just something about Chris that really appealed to my upbringing uh, in Calgary. It was yeah. kind of like a he, he had a very punchy style. He's a very <laughs> like forward action thinking mm -hmm. man, and yeah. Uh, yeah, we were in the same acting class, and then. Uh, I would always think that he's a very, very funny guy, and, and we would make lots of fun jokes yeah. together in acting class. Yeah. Great. And then, uh, yeah. Peter, uh, sorry, Chris, <laughs> tell them about that one time. That one time when we were, uh, you know, when we were going, we were in your dad's truck. And oh, we, yeah, yeah. And, no. and then we were like, <laughs> okay. You, you wanna... we, um, we took my dad's truck out one afternoon uh -huh. um, in Victoria. My dad had lent it to us for the afternoon to do, like, jobs, and we... Uh, I successfully crashed my dad's truck into a into a fence. Yeah, and it was over six thousand dollars worth of damage. Yeah, and I tried to blame it all on Peter because yeah. he was he had his driver, he had his learner's license at the time, so he was driving. Yeah, yeah. and uh, <laughs> but, but I I took full blame it for it. It fell on it fell yeah. on Chris. But now it's out. The secret's out. Yeah. And what did your dad say? Oh, you oh well, he wasn't happy at all. But he was uh, he was on the phone with the insurance companies for days, days, days. days. Well, I'm sorry to hear about that. <laughs> and um, what is the importance of recognizing and celebrating Canadian talent to each of you? Well, it's, I mean, it's just important to to celebrate what we're doing. You know, it's like it doesn't get a you don't get a lot of opportunity to to do that. It's great. I don't know. Yeah. I'm just I'm just happy to be in this interview. <laughs> well, thank you. And where's the best place to find out more information on you guys and your boundary pushing material online? www.peterandchris.com. Just Peter, capital N, Chris.com. Great. Yeah. Thanks so much. Congratulations and good luck tonight. Thanks, Thanks a lot. Thank you. Thanks. Again. I'm Katie Allman reporting for Katie Chats at the Canadian Comedy Awards in Ottawa. Maybe by Catalfo for providing me with this beautiful dress and the lovely Stella Margaritas for providing me with jewelry for tonight's festivities.